I am Coach Tony Morgan of the Masterful Engineer Programme and today's boiler, well it's not a boiler today, it's an unvented cylinder, is a heat ray stadia mega flow and the situation today is we've come out to this unit and they're saying they're not getting no hot water, we've established a problem which was a thermostat. However, we've recommended to the customer that they need a timer fitted on the unit because you can see here it's got this spur switch which goes to the bottom immersion heater and the top immersion heater is not connected. So I said to get the best efficiency out of this unit is to have this one connected to the timer. But as I said, there's no timer fitted. I'm going to fit an Economy 7 timer. So the bottom one will work off the overnight setting on Economy 7 hours. And the top one will work on the boost operation. Now with this setup, if you've got just switches like this and no timer, it means you're going to be heating your water in the peak time, which you're going to be using more base of fuel and the bills are going to be higher so I recommend that you have a timer fitted if you've all got these switches so we're going to fit a new timer on this and you'll see the setup what we've got incidentally if you've got switches as I said just like this some installations do have a timer on a consumer unit so you can look on your consumer unit and to see if there's a built-in timer here. If there was one, it would be here, where them three blanks are, but there's none fitted. So this is why we're going to fit an external timer onto this installation. Okay, now you can see we've gone and changed the um, spur switch, and we've gone and put a now a new Economy 7 timer, as you can see, and. I've connected up the top immersion heater so now the customer just has to press the boost button which is here you can see it's lit up and then that will give them one hour's hot water and what's happening it's going to save them a lot of money because now we'll just heat the top part of the um, unvented cylinder as opposed to heating the full tank and um, costing a lot more money but in this case we're going to save a lot of money now and the bottom immersion heater this will come on on the off peak setting which is this light here and that's where the electricity is cheaper so it does save money on their fuel bills so if you're a customer who's got a system like this and you want to save money on your fuel you know who to call. Just click on the link below and you can go directly to our website. If you're an engineer looking to do bar repair training, there's an alternative link for you. You can click on that on our Masterful Engineer program. So that's the end of this video. So if you like what you've seen, do a like or you can subscribe to our channel. So that's it for now and thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.